Jesus knew what the future held for him. We often don't know what the future holds for us. And we do a lot of speculating. Our speculations are based on the limited knowledge that we have about our circumstances. Um, they're based on our past experiences. They're based on our personalities, such as whether we think the cup is half full or half empty. Um, they're based on wishful thinking and uh, therefore the speculations don't always reflect what is to come. But speculating about the future can cause a lot of fear and anxiety and uncomfortable okay. feelings. Even when our expectations of the future are evidence-based, life is full of uncertainties, surprises, challenges that may make our expectations totally void. And so we need something else to trust, to depend on, to make it easy for us to overcome this waiting process. Waiting for the unknown can be really, really difficult. Here are a couple of verses from the Old Testament and the New Testament, which hopefully we might find helpful. Deuteronomy 31 verse 8 says, It is the Lord who goes before you. He will be with you. He will not leave you or forsake you. Do not fear or be dismayed. And from the New Testament, Philippians 4, verse 7 says, And peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. The peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. However difficult it may be for us to wait, whether for a medical result or a financial situation or a relational uh, outcome or an exam result or a job offer, we need to know that God stands with us all the time. And he is the one who is able to give us peace at all times. He will at all times go before us. He will be with us. He will not leave us nor forsake us. And he will always give us peace. With that in mind, let's pray and bring our situations before God. Father God, we thank you that you are the giver of peace. We thank you that you hold everything in your hands. And sometimes anxiety takes over us and we don't know what the future holds. Thinking about situations that unfold before our eyes, we struggle. And we pray that your presence might be so with us, so tangibly reaching out to us enveloping us. Your love might be so evident in our hearts and in our lives. Your peace might be evident in our minds that we would know that it is you who is giving us the strength to carry on. We pray that you would enable us to trust you for the future. We pray that we would know the mighty hand of our Father holding our hands and leading us on green pastures. Father, as we sit in your presence, we ask for your peace. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.